Right, so uh, welcome Aaron. Um, Aaron um, is about to tell you his story really from um, his journey with us at Grange Fitness and Postgrade Bootcamps all to where he is now. So um, we're back in the room where it all started for you. Um, it was about January the 3rd, 4th, 2012. Um, how does that make you feel? Um, well, I've seen this room a lot over the last year, that's, that's the honest story. Um, I do remember back in January it being a very nervous day coming in for the first time, not really too sure what to expect. Um, thought I might be a little bit intimidated, to be honest, yeah. being there with kind of people who were a bit fitter than me, but no, that certainly wasn't the case. So yeah, yeah pretty good. So what? Um, tell me about why why you signed up for boot camp, what your um, what your reasons were. And, yeah. Um, yeah. Okay, well it was a mixture really of, of health and weight that I was looking at. I was weighing in at about 17 and a half stone just before starting boot camp. I uh, had high blood pressure and I was having to take a tablet every day to get that back to a normal healthy level. Um, and so it was a combination of wanting to lose that weight to get fit again, but also there was a genuine health reason for wanting to do it as well. Okay, good. And how did you sign up for boot camp? So did, did you know somebody who was already doing it? Did you, where did you hear about what, or how about the boot camp? Well, it was actually for a friend, um, one of the mums at the schools had heard about it. Um, I think there was a free taster session initially, as there always is on a monthly basis. Um, and she told me about that. And I have to admit, my first thought was, you know, that, that's the last thing I want to do to go and join the. So boot camp's a four-week course. Yeah. You finished the first four weeks. Tell me about how you felt, um, what sort of results you got, and how you found the nutritional plan, which obviously is one of the key ingredients. Okay. Well, I think I think the first thing to say, as I mentioned earlier, about being a little bit nervous and apprehensive. I mean, that that couldn't have been more misplaced, really. Great thing about boot camp is the sense of team that you get, and the sense of being part of something. Um, so really enjoy that bonding over the month and that team spirit of, of people all with you know similar goals and different levels of fitness. You know, there's no need for anyone to be intimidated coming into a boot camp. It's so great. If I think back, it was that it was that 12, 12 or thirteen of you on that yeah. camp. Wasn't yeah, yeah, there was, and it was a, you know it was a it was a predominantly female attendance. I think there was about sort of three or four guys and about eight or nine ladies on it. But, um, but you know, a great kind of spirit and atmosphere within the camp. So we re really enjoyed it, first of all, which was important. And I think maybe it took me a session to lose that sort of that initial being slightly concerned about it and sort of getting into it. And you know, I'm probably a naturally shy person anyway, whereas, you know, someone more outgoing might not even have that sort of coming into it. But um, in terms of results, I mean, fantastic. In, in just a month, we managed to, sh or I personally managed to shift about 18 pounds of weight, so about a stone and a half nearly, in terms of weight loss, which was fantastic. Um, I think it was seven centimeters off my waist in those first, in the first four weeks, five centimeters off the chest. And I think just a general feeling of, of well-being and being much healthier than I was coming into the camp. Um, and I think what it did was it gave me a sense of how, how quickly, with the right approach and the right food backing it up, how quickly results could be achieved. So it really motivated me for the rest of the journey, sort of beyond that initial boot camp. And you mentioned the, the food. This is um, the, the Fit for Life plan, which yeah. is what our original state that we had it in. Um, boot campers follow it, and, and we get our gym members to follow, follow it as well. So how did you find that compared to what you would normally eat? And obviously you've got passion into food, which yeah. we'll talk about in a minute. Um, but how did you find, how, how that was all set up? And well, before, before coming onto boot camp, I've tried several diets in the past. Um, I think, you know, the, the very first impression of Fit for Life is it isn't a diet, first of all, most importantly, it's a lifestyle change. Um, and actually, you know, the, the thing I've learned over the last 18 months is that, that that's the way to lose weight. It's through a lifestyle change. It's through recognising, you know, the right way to eat for life. Um, not about a fad diet and sort of achieving short-term results that you end up losing very quickly when you come off a diet. 
So I think that was important. I think, um, you know, I am passionate about food. It allowed me to eat five times a day, which was great, you know, compared to other diets. Um, and I think fundamentally, the thing about Fit for Life is it's about eating wholesome, healthy, good food. So actually, you know, it's not that intimidating looking at it. You're, looking, you're, you're trying to eat well, you're trying to eat good food. Um, and certainly through the boot camp, you know, I was 100% strict on that plan. And, you know, no doubt at all it delivers results. I can honestly say I never, was never hungry at all through that initial boot camp. Mm -hmm. yeah, if you follow the plan and you follow it right, there's no need to be sort of hungry, really. It's um, fantastic. Yeah, I mean, the one boot camp. Yeah. yeah. So, um, after that, you decided what direction did you want to go in and tell me about that? Um, well, I finished the boot camp and basically joined the gym here. Yeah. So, um, the boot camp gave me the platform I needed. To, it, uh, the biggest thing it gave me was the motivation to train. Um, and I was confident sort of coming off a month of that that I could you know, commit myself to a gym membership here. So, I've been a gym membership gym member here since the end of boot camp. Um, been training typically post boot camp about kind of five days a week, so taking sort of two rest days a week, a um, mixture of weight sessions, um, attending some of the classes here. Um, great thing about the classes is it's a social environment, it's getting sent back to some of the guys on the boot camp. So that's good, but also having the motivation to come in and train in the weights room um, or on the treadmill on my own, you know, um, boot camp's giving me that motivation really. Good. And you also set up, um, well, I say you set up, we, we arranged some fun runs. Yeah. And you helped organise um, sort of regular running clubs, which obviously our staff were unable to do with other commitments, but yeah. a group of you started to go out running and still do on the occasions now, don't you? But yeah, well, it sprung out of, um, I think, the gym signed up to do, it was initially. Spartan race that we signed up. June, July last year, wasn't it? 2012. Yeah, which for the benefit of those that don't know, was a, a 5k adventure race, sort of uh, knee deep in mud and various other obstacles. So basically, uh, what we set up was a Wednesday evening running club to get people sort of in shape for that. Again, you know, great kind of social aspect to it in terms of getting everyone together. It was doing the race, everyone motivated. So yeah, that, that kind of built up over a few weeks, again, a real kind of mixture of levels and abilities in the running club. And you know, over the first few weeks, gradually easing the distance up and everybody managing to kind of stay with that. And I think, you know, it helped get everybody in shape for the Spartan race. And then subsequently, the two races that we've done since, I think we've done Guts and Glory and uh, an Avalanche, which was similar yeah. events. Um, and I think, you know, the really, the really great thing about those has been seeing the number of people from the gym of, of all abilities and all the different places in their own personal journeys, but all of them coming along and, and achieving, you know, achieving a successful 